Hello my Hello Kitty fans, this is Hello Gabius and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another Hello Kitty haul and it's items from Funko Pop, from Barnes & Nobles, from Amazon, um, I think it's High Five Store. I mean there's just so many places that I have accrued things that I buy of Hello Kitty. I wait till I gather quite a few and then I show it to you guys. So. This is the haul. First, I wanna show you Funko Pop. So I have two. This one is number 32. This Funko Pop came out uh, maybe even last year sometime. Um, this really caught my eye because it is completely blank. So now, uh, what I thought with this one is, uh, obviously you get to color it, you get to dress it up, you know, choose whatever colors you like. But what I wanna do is, uh, as a surprise to my husband, because he's been so supportive of me, my channel, of me buying Hello Kitty items and stuff. I want to actually uh, let him borrow this so that he can uh, camouflage it. He can do whatever he likes and then I will display it in my office. So I do want to give him that opportunity to be able to do whatever he likes with this Hello Kitty. And then let's see what he comes up with and I'll let you know. I'll show that to you when he's done. So. First item, number 32 Funko Pop. Second item is another Funko Pop and I kept it in the box because I just wanna let you know when you order from Funko Pop, this is how careful their packaging is. They will individually have a cardboard little box for each Funko Pop box. So I really wanted to show that to you. I saw that and I thought, wow, they really, really invest in making sure that you get your Funko Pop in one piece, no dents, no scratches. And I got number 28. So this is the Pride one. It's such a pretty Hello Kitty. It's almost translucent. Obviously it has a rainbow coloring. Um, and I love that they kept the red bow, but it's almost translucent when you see it and uh, but it's she's just beautiful so this is number 28 next item is something to help me get ready and to help me with my second youtube channel hello gabius and it is Emira. it's from impressions and it's a hello kitty led handheld mirror and it has a magnetic base and i love it and it's a pretty big mirror just so you can see and so this is a magnetic park, and this is the base here. And it's skate proof here. And then you just take it. I like it because you can have it, I accidentally pushed that, okay. I like it because you can have it leaning and it doesn't fall off, I mean, at all. Here is where you have the cord to be able to charge it and it has USB charging. And then of course it has the light. So it's just an on and off, but that's okay uh, because this really helps me uh, when I get ready and I will have this on my desk for when I get ready, especially for any beauty tutorials that I may have on my other YouTube channel. So I absolutely love this mirror. Next are journals. And of course, if you know me, I love journals, 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 notebooks, anything. Um, I was able to purchase five journals from Barnes and Nobles and they ranged about $6 each. This is the first notebook and they're soft cover. And it has a mermaid, nothing on the back. Um, and it is lined. And there's nothing inside the pages. But lined journals, notebooks are my absolute favorite. So this is the first one. The second one is so cute. It's a primary composition notebook. And it is pink. And she does have her little wings. And this is more like for schoolwork, like for uh, grade school kids. Uh, you can help them with alphabet numbers and things like that so love it next one is just like the ping pong but it's blue and this one is lined though it's different from the pink one inside okay the next one looks the same this is blue but this is like a a purplish and it says draw and write journal 
So again, it's like the pink one that you can go ahead and draw and then you can write the story on the drawing or whatever. Definitely very good for uh, grade school kids. The last journal, it's just called Notebook and again, it is another mermaid and I wanna show you the first one just so you can see the comparison. So this is the first one and then this is the second one, nothing in the back and it is lined. So I love, love, love journals, especially lined journal. Next, I went to the High Five store. They just opened a High Five store here on the west side here in El Paso, Texas. I saw this there and I thought, wow, I have never had this little book. And I thought, yay, I can add it to my collection. I really like it. It says, what is the story of Hello Kitty? I do like this little book because it actually gives you a timeline of Hello Kitty. Very, very cool. Next at the Hi-Fi store, I bought some stickers. So I was surprised to see uh, Hello Kitty stickers. I was glad that I saw this little book and I did see stickers as well. And these are really cute. And I like it that they do have them um, clamped here in the corner so you can just feather. There's like six pages in here. Very, very cool. They're all the same stickers basically. But that's very, very cool. So stickers and i bought another set of stickers that i found there i'm like wow that's really awesome i do need to go back to see if they have anything new of hello kitty so this is hello senrio hello kitty stickers then i went to target and i bought some greeting cards i did buy three halloween greeting cards that i don't have with me because i have mailed them out already but i did buy two happy birthday cards and this is from papyrus and this is a very good brand especially when they collaborate with hello kitty because it makes such beautiful Hello Kitty cards. Uh, Christmas, Halloween, um, I haven't seen an Easter one, but this happy birthday one is just so, so cute. And of course I do have my Hello Kitty pen pals. And of course I do want to keep up with sending them, you know, happy birthday cards and whatnot. And on, I believe it was Instagram or Facebook, I saw one of uh, my Hello Kitty friends and her name is Kate Archuleta. So, Hi to Kate, if you're seeing this video, uh, she posted two pins that she purchased from Amazon and I saw them and I thought, wow, I need to have those. And these are the pins that I'm talking about. These are two Hello Kitty and their pewter. I don't remember the price I paid for them, but look at how beautiful they are. I can always add to my Hello Kitty pin collection so so cool next is uh, a gift that i got from my niece and nephew from california so they went to the store and they saw the hello kitty soy sauce and though this is not a new product in fact i've already purchased a soy sauce like this before at world market and i've already used it but it doesn't hurt to have some more so hello kitty soy sauce and I saved the best for last because my niece and nephew sent me a bobblehead. And this is what I'm talking about. This is a 2013 Dodgers Hello Kitty bobblehead. I mean, wow. I've always wanted to go to a Dodgers game, especially because sometimes they do have Hello Kitty night. And of course, depending on the price of the ticket that you get, you get free. You could get maybe like a free blanket or whatever they're giving for free uh, for Hello Kitty. And I've always wanted something. I've always wanted to go to an LA Dodgers game, especially on Hello Kitty night. Um, but that hasn't been in my plan so far. But I mean, look at, look at, ah, ah, how cute. So she's wearing her little outfit in the back. It does say 2013. And let me just say that she is in pristine condition. She is just beautiful. And of course I am a collector, but a collector that opens her boxes. And so I do want to enjoy what I get, but she's just so beautiful. And of course she's at home base here. Look at that. And she's holding her little baseball and she's ready to play. The box itself is also very nice. And of course I keep all my boxes as well. It says Hello Kitty 2013 with her hat. And on the other side, it's a bat 
Um, and then of course here she's ready to bat and then here it just shows what's in the box. So um, I absolutely love it. Um, as far as my favorite from this haul, I mean, of course, this is my favorite because this is my hometown, Los Angeles. And when I saw this, I just melted to the floor because this is like something I've always wanted to get. So I'm very thankful. So thank you, Jasmine and Tony. And I want to say that my, I have a lot of favorites actually in this haul because definitely this is a favorite. And then, of course, my Funko Pops are favorites. I love, love my Hello Kitty Funko Pops. I love my journals. And then, of course, the pins. I mean, so I think that just everything is my favorite in this haul. Uh, but let me know what is your favorite. And let me know if you already own some of these items. Also, I'm very curious. Let me know if you know anything about LA Dodgers and Hello Kitty Night. Uh, do you normally go for the ones that do live in Los Angeles? And um, I really, when I've searched, don't see a schedule of Hello Kitty. So I don't even know, how would I even find out? Will you enlighten me, whoever does know? Because I do not mind taking a trip from El Paso to LA just to go to the Dodgers game because it's Hello Kitty night. That's how dedicated I am. And I will meet you if you are inviting me. I will definitely go and I'll meet you there and we can sit together and enjoy. Ellie Dodger Hello Kitty Night. So will you let me know more information on, I understand that right now they're closing down a lot of businesses because of the coronavirus, but if you see anything in the future that's coming up, please let me know. I want to thank you guys so much for watching my video and I do invite you to watch my second YouTube channel, Hello Gabbyist. And so that is really non Hello Kitty, uh, but uh, it is me. But I do uh, invite you and I do invite you to subscribe. So if you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up. Also, if you have not subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit that bell notification to notify you of when I upload a new Hello Kitty video. Thank you so much for watching. Please stay safe during this pandemic and have a great day.